Bonjour et bienvenue à Learn French with Alexa. Today, folks, I would like to teach you uh, part three of jobs. So I've titled this video Les métiers, troisième partie. Les métiers, troisième partie. By the way, métier means job. So if you want to ask someone, what is your job? You would say, quel est ton métier? Ou quel est votre métier? Okay? Now, here we go. These are the words I've chosen. An air hostess is une hôtesse de l'air. Or l'hôtesse de l'air, if you wanted to say the air hostess. Now, for a boy, a boy, a man, it is le steward. Okay, le steward with a French accent. Okay. The bricklayer is le maçon. Le maçon. So watch the spelling here. It has a C cédilla. Okay. And when you see a little five under the C, this is called a cédilla. And it makes the sound s and not k. So le maçon. Okay. You've got the same in garçon, for example. Okay. Garçon. Le maçon. And I hear that the feminine version of le maçon is la maçonne. Now, if you know otherwise, please leave a comment here because that I am not 100% sure, okay? Le chauffeur de car or le conducteur de car, okay? And this is the bus driver or the coach driver. Now, I think we tend to say conducteur more nowadays. So, le conducteur de car ou la conductrice de car if it's a lady, okay? Remember that I'm using le as the or un as a, okay? Either way. L'homme d'affaires, that's the businessman. L'homme d'affaires ou la femme d'affaires, if it was a lady businessman, businesswoman. <laughs> what? <laughs> L'homme d'affaires et la femme d'affaires, okay? Le chef. And that's the chef, okay? Ou la chef, possibly. La cuisinière, if it was a lady cook. Ou le cuisinier, if it was a man cook, okay? But you can say le chef as well. Now, cleaner is a funny one. I had to look for this one in my dictionaries, okay? Because we say, obviously, femme de ménage for house cleaner, as in maid. Okay, femme de ménage, but homme de ménage as well, okay? Uh, homme as in a man, a femme as in a woman. But there is a technical term for cleaner, which is le technicien de surface. Le technicien de surface or la technicienne de surface. Okay? Now, I don't know, you choose whatever uh, suits you best, really. Um, pharmacist. The pharmacist in French is le pharmacien or un pharmacien. Okay, now have a look. Pharmacien. Now, quite often if you have I-E-N jobs, okay, word, and if you wanted the feminine version of that word, you add another N-E. So, for uh, pharmacien in a female uh, word would be, feminine word would be pharmacienne. Okay, can you say that? So, Je suis pharmacienne. Okay, I am a pharmacist. Surgeon. Now, surgeon is le chirurgien. That's quite a mouthful. Le chirurgien. Very hard because you have two R next to each other, practically. Chirurgien. Chirurgien ou la chirurgienne. Okay, I can't even say it. La chirurgienne for a lady surgeon. Okay, so le chirurgien. La chirurgienne, that's quite, uh, quite hard to say. And teacher, teacher is a funny one because like teacher in France will argue their title, okay? I think they are called nowadays in France professeur des écoles. Professeur des écoles, so teacher at school. Professeur des écoles primaires, if it's a primary school. Professeur des collèges, if it's secondary school. Professeur des lycées, if it's sixth form or high school. I'm not sure what the equivalent is in your country. So, this is what we use. The old term that uh, French people used to use uh, is instituteur. Okay, so you had l'instituteur ou 
l'institutrice. Now, this term is used only for teachers in primary school. Okay, so if you are one out there in France, let me know what we call you. What is your title nowadays? Is it professeur des écoles or instituteur? Okay, so let's have a look at the list again. Air hostess is l'hôtesse de l'air. Now, répétez. Très bien. Ou le steward. Steward. I'm not sure I'm saying that probably. Steward. Le maçon. That's the brake la layer. La maçonne. Supposedly the feminine version of the brake layer. Le chauffeur de car. Ou le conducteur de car. Feminine version. La conductrice de car. Ou la conductrice, as in a driver of any vehicle. L'homme d'affaires, la femme d'affaires, le chef ou la chef, ou la cuisinière ou le cuisinier. And by the way, chef means boss as well, so you know, yeah? As in, uh, je dois parler à mon chef, I must talk to my boss, yeah? L'homme de ménage, this one is funny, so l'homme de ménage, la femme de ménage, that's the cleaner, but also known as le technicien de surface, or if it was a girl, la technicienne de surface. Le pharmacien ou la pharmacienne, le pharmacien ou la pharmacienne, ok le chirurgien ou la chirurgienne. Ok? Le chirurgien ou la chirurgienne. And to finish, le professeur. I'm going to keep it as le professeur. So, professeur de mathématiques, professeur d'anglais, le professeur de français, le professeur de sciences physiques, le professeur, etc. etc. So, you get what I mean here. Yeah? So, why don't you tell me what job you do okay and write a comment under here so you could say je suis hôtesse de l'air i'm an air hostess je suis maçon i'm a builder okay and maçon by that i mean all kind of trades yeah you could be a carpenter and still call yourself maçon if you were in a construction industry okay but carpenter obviously charpentier we have a word for it now uh, je suis chef dans un restaurant etc, etc. Moi, je suis professeur de français. Ok, that's my job. Ok, that's it for me. Uh, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not done so already. And why don't you buy the Bisou Bisou t-shirt that I'm wearing today. Au revoir, à bientôt. Bisou Bisou. Bye bye. Bye bye. Au revoir. <laughs> Silly. Cut.